I'm in Toronto, Canada today at the Business of Aging Summit, and I'm going to sit down with the founder of Sharp Brains, which is a neuroscience research facility, and we're going to discuss cognitive training. Now, tell me a little bit about your company. Uh, Sharp Brains is a market research company. We try to summarize all the research on how to stay sharp as we get older. And so we cover all the new innovations from the research side and also from the product side. So what have you um, seen the most promise in as far as technology um, with the cognitive training? There is now a lot of programs for, uh, to help teenagers and also older adults drive safer. To drive a car, I mean, it's very complex. You have to be paying attention to many different things. You have to make a lot of decisions. So it's very heavy on a part of the brain called the frontal lobe. But there is a very interesting similar study going on in London, comparing the London cab drivers and London bus drivers, and how parts of the brain evolve as they get older. Uh, and London taxi drivers, the physical part of the brain that deals with learning memory, called the hippocampus physically grows bigger simply by being a taxi driver because every day they have to figure out how I'm going to drive from this place to another place versus the bus driver is, is not growing. In fact, it's getting smaller just because of the effect of aging. What 